Hey, I'm Joseph from TechAU, and this is my racing sim that I've been working on for a number of years. And recently it's had a couple of upgrades from Moza, their racing wheel, the R12 base, the pedals, but some extra additions over on this side, which I'm going to show you now. The one big missing piece from the Moza lineup of accessories for their racing sim uh, was really a sequential shifter. And this week, they solved it. So brand new this week is this guy, the Moser Racing Sequential Shifter. Moser have offered a H pattern shifter for quite a while. There have been some third party options to make that into a sequential shifter, but this is the real deal. Sounds great, solid build quality, couple of configurable buttons here, and of course it sits next to their great handbrake as well. So combining these all together makes for an unbelievable racing experience, something that I've been enjoying for the last little bit. So now it's time to have a look at the sequential shifter in action. I'll be firing up a set of Corsa, but of course this works in many games. And it's perfect for those vehicles like our V8 supercars that use sequential shifters in reality to give you that immersive real life experience. So as you can see, the sequential shifter works really great. It's got a great solid feel when you grab hold of it. That clicking sound, very substantial. Maybe that's a little loud for some people. They might want to have a, a, some kind of dampening to turn that down, but I think it's really rewarding to sort of pull through the gears and, and to be able to shift up. That compared to using paddle shifts or even the H pedal, none of those sort of come together to give you that immersive feel in cars that do genuinely use sequential shifts. So great to have options. And uh, I think this is a great addition to the Moser lineup. Read some more at techau.com.au. Thanks, guys.